All right, guys, we are back with another massive PSA return. 161 cards. I graded vintage, modern, alt arts, and of course, some surprises. So let's just get right into it. But first, don't forget to like this video and please subscribe to the channel. All right, guys, starting off strong with some vintage, we have a Chansey Shadowless in a PSA 9. I am collecting all Chanseys in high grade, so I'm very happy about that one. We got a first edition Neo Discovery Espeon PSA 4. First edition Neo Gen Togetic. We're starting off real strong here with the first Eds and the vintage in a PSA 8. I told you there would be some random surprises. Here we go with the Captain America in a PSA 7. We got a Ninetales Hollow in a PSA 8. Shadowless Blastoise in a 6. I think I graded a couple of these, so we'll see what else we get back in this return. Raichu PSA 8. Little friend for him in a PSA 7. Here it is. Ooh, we got an 8 this time. Shadowless Blastoise in a PSA 8. We take that and a Clefairy in a PSA 8. Getting right into the next stack with a first edition Neo Rev Blissey PSA 7. I love Neo Rev. All the Neo sets, but um, I don't know. Neo Rev is definitely my favorite. This card is absolutely beautiful. We got a 4 on this one. And another Chansey PSA 8. And another Shadowless to go with our PSA 7. Oh my gosh. Shadowless Venusaur PSA 8. I love it. The Shadowless cards are just so beautiful. Oh my gosh. Another Nine Tails, PSA 9. Ooh, our first Ed got a 1! Oh my gosh. I don't think I've ever gotten a 1 on a card before, but I mean, you guys can tell this one is super beat up. But I wanted to have it graded in my collection, so that's the reason why I graded this one. And actually, this is really cool. I think this is my first PSA 1 in my collection, so... Woohoo, there are a lot of PSA 1 collectors out there. I do actually like the ones, they're really cool. And a Raichu Fossil in a PSA 9. We got some bangers in this pile. This is definitely one of my favorite cards from Fire Red Leaf Green. The Gengar EX is just so cool with the purple on purple. Love it. We got a 6, we'll take it. We got some uh, modern secret rares coming in Silver Tempest, Evolving Skies. Some nice tens, Glugia in a nine. Ooh, I forgot I graded this one. Do you guys ever forget that you grade stuff and then you get it back and you're just very excited about it? That happens to me all the time. Chilling Rain, okay. We know Chilling Rain isn't the greatest, but there are some cool cards in there. Chilling Pain, but I mean like, come on. It's got some cool secret rares and some awesome alt arts, if you can hit them. All right, you know it's not a PSA return if I didn't grade any Fortnite, so here we go. Cracked Ice, Frozen Fish Stick in a 9. I don't know what's happening with uh, with Fortnite right now, but uh, yeah, those are cards that I'm definitely going to be holding on to for a long time. Ooh, the New York Comic Con uh, promo that I got from uh, a couple months ago at Comic Con, that's cool. Got a 6, and of course I always sneak in some Weiss cards as well, so sorry if you guys aren't Weiss fans, but I gotta... Okay, I graded a lot of these cards, so I'm going to spare you by going through all them. I think I got a 9, a 7, and then the rest are all 10s. This was the first promo from uh, the new set, Scarlet and Violet. So that was a cool one to get my hands on and grade a bunch of. Oh, the Aerodactyl art on this is so nice. We got a PSA 8. First Ed Team Rocket Blastoise, Dark Blastoise, PSA 8. Brock's nine tails in a nine. Ooh, a dark Zard. We got a nine. Heck yeah, we take nines all day. And my favorite card. All right, we got a PSA eight. This is by far, if you guys know me and you've been following me for a while, you know Persian is my favorite. This art is the absolute best. Um, I don't have a lot of the first Eds graded, so I'm very excited to add this one to my collection. And a first Ed. Team Rocket Dark Ride Shoot in a PSA eight. We got some more Fortnite. Ooh, the Vivid Voltage Cracked Ice. Um, catch them all collectibles. Dan told me to grade these, so I did. We got a nine, a nine. Oh, and this is my first um, Coro Coro promo that came back graded. So cool. We got a seven on this. This is uh, really interesting. You guys can get these from the uh, the magazines, Coro Coro magazine from Japan, and they had these little Fortnite um, inserts in them. So I actually got a bunch more, and I just sent them off to PSA. So. We'll see how those come back. Some soul rings, MTG in nines. Let's go. All right, speaking of chilling pain, come on. You, you just can't hate on this card. The Blaziken VMAX full art in a PSA 10. We love it. And battle styles, the Sleepy T-Tar got a 10. So excited. 
Yes, friends in Galar from Silver Tempest got a 10. I love grading modern. Oh my gosh, I love seeing the 10s. It's amazing. Gengar, VMAX. I think we might have a whole alt art pile here. Let's go. The Charizard from the UPC PSA 9. I thought it was going to get a 9, so I'm happy with that. I'll take it. Uh, Charizard. Rainbow Rare. Oh, and a nice little vintage in here. We got a Shadowless Gyarados taking home a 7. We love it. Leafy on VMAX and a 10. And another Sleepy Titar and a 10. Let's go. If you guys are liking the return, make sure you like this video and subscribe to the channel. I got a lot more on the way. Trust me. Could barely keep up. <laughs> um, also, we all see the grades together for the first time here. Um, let me know if you guys are team look ahead or team wait to see your grades. I'm definitely team wait. I don't know, I just love the surprise. Ooh, Charizard base set hollow got a seven. Oh, I'm very happy about this one. Yeah, I just love the surprise of um, of seeing them come out of the box and seeing what grades I get. So another nine. These are all from the $15 TCG special and non-sports special, by the way, from uh, a couple months ago. I know PSA often does a lot of specials like that, so make sure that you guys Keep your eyes peeled when they do specials and um, make sure that you're a collector's club member because we get, oh, here it is in 10. We get special perks like that um, and you guys can take advantage of all of the PSA specials, which definitely helps me grade cards that I typically wouldn't grade, which actually we definitely, definitely will see some in here in the next pile I'm going to show you. So that $15 special just gives us more room to grade things that we just want to keep in our collection or that we just like or, you know, typically wouldn't grade. Ooh, Shadow Me Too got a nine. Heck yeah. And then more of these promos. Modern has done really well so far, so I'm definitely not going to stop grading Modern cards anytime soon. Um, here we go with the PSA 6 first edition Gym Heroes. I love this card. I don't care. I'm grading this. I don't care what it's going to come back. I am grading that for my collection all day long. Ooh, okay, let's go. So we have the first edition uh, Ghost Stamp error card. They actually recognize this. That's cool. Um, I wasn't sure if they were going to, so make sure you guys can see that little uh, first edition there. It's just barely there, so they call that the Ghost Stamp error. Never had one of these in my collection. Um, I picked it up raw, obviously, and graded it, so I thought it was really cool, and... Uh, Happy with a three. Kind of expected that. It's not in great condition or anything, but again, you got to grade what you like, keep it in your collection, and uh, grade what makes you happy. I'm really happy to add that one to my collection. All right, we got some Fossil PSA 9s. Ooh, a gold star. Okay, we got a PSA 3 on the Power Keepers Vaporeon gold star. Beautiful. That's another thing that I'm going to grade at... Uh, like, no matter what the condition is, gold stars are always something that I am grading. All right, we got a PSA 10 on the Dark Ray Orange Refractor, 19 out of 25. I pulled this one myself. So happy it tend. Um, I don't typically grade Star Wars cards, so that is a great example of something that I would take advantage of the uh, $15 special for at PSA. And, you know, my favorite skin in Fortnite, Hayes, had to grade her. Got a 9 on the Cracked Ice. Love it. So you guys are definitely seeing a lot of alt arts in here and a lot of modern. Um, I took advantage of the um, TCG player special. I think it was like eight bu uh, eight percent like bonus bucks back or something. So I bought up a bunch of the uh, alt arts and then basically spent enough to get money back to buy more cards. So that was awesome. I don't know how I feel about this one. I'm happy I got a ten though. Uh, is this card too chaotic? I know a lot, of, it's either you love that card or you hate that card. And I, I, somehow I'm the outlier that's like in the middle. I don't know if I love it or I hate it. All right, one thing we can all agree on though is Legendary Collection, absolutely stunning. The reverse hollows are just insanely cool. Believe it or not, this is definitely one of my favorite ones in the return. I don't know why I'm drawn to it. Just the colors, the green and the blue are so epic together. Also, Tornadus just made his debut in uh, Raids in Pokemon Go, so maybe that's why I like it so much. But um, these Plasma Freeze and Plasma Storm cards, I have been really loving a lot. Oh, 10, 10, 10. 
Dragon Frontiers, hollow, whoo, in a nine. What an awesome promo this is. Oh my gosh. The cosplay Pikachu. Look at all the little Pikachus in there, all dressed up. I love it. This one's so cool. We got a seven. This is from 2014. You guys know I love my Japanese promos, so all day I'm buying, buying and grading Japanese promos. Little Doug Trio, and of course, our promo. All right, guys, we are somehow already down to our last pile here, so if you're liking the return so far, please like the video, drop a comment with what your favorite card was or five favorite cards. I know there's so many cool ones in here, and please subscribe to the channel. You guys can count on me for always having uh, at least some interesting surprises in my returns. Wow, okay, so every single Vivid Voltage Cracked Ice card got a nine. This one got an eight, but this is not the same. Um, interesting, they all got nines. Oh my God, see, here we go. Something I completely forgot that somehow made it in here. <laughs> we got another uh, Star Wars Masterwork. Did I pull this one myself? I think I did pull this one myself at uh, Star Wars in Disney. So that's pretty cool. Cool memory. Some more MetaZoo and Weiss. <laughs> business card, I need a business card like that. And, the Arceus V. Brilliant stars. I don't know why I did that crazy pause. I just wanted something awesome to end on, but... Just get out of here, you stupid, dumb animal! <laughs> well, it's a wrap. I hope that you guys enjoyed that massive PSA return. If you did, please like the video, drop a comment, and subscribe to the channel. I will be coming back with a lot more PSA returns. And just a reminder, this was all from the $15 special that PSA was dropping for Collectors Club members. I highly recommend you guys become a Collectors Club member at PSA. You get so many perks and get to take advantage of these awesome $15 uh, TCG and non-sports deals that they do. So go sign up and stay tuned for more PSA returns. Like and subscribe to the channel. And thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys soon.